Hello friends, today we are going to show you number of uh, different type of locking poles which we have and depending upon the section, wind load, type of uh, gasket used uh, and uh, the requirement uh, in commercials we define which locking point out of our range could be used. This was very earlier uh, Typhon type of locking pole which is used along with the suitable striker. Now this is applicable along with this type of strikers but in this adjustment was not there hence uh, we developed it to this type of pole as you can see here. Now again we keep on developing depending upon client's requirement we have developed this again this type of locking pole then this for this you need a flat type of uh, striker to lock like this or this type of striker is required in this guru is there in the outer profile these are a range of uh, uh, just like this poles are there these are the range of strikers which we have now recently we have introduce this locking pole which is good enough to take the strength for PMU testings and it can be combined along with this type of striker or you can use a shorter striker like this here this is, this is very uh, strong combination or you can use this type of uh, striker or simply this type of uh, striker in the groove also to reduce cost more at the same time not uh, reducing or compromising the quality of the of the performance in PMU testing we have recently developed uh, to uh, this poll in which we suggest client to use this poll by punching a hole in the uh, polyamide strip or aluminum strip and put the pole like this and to be punched and insert uh, riveted from the back side it happens to be like this it, if it is done well with the on machine this is done by hand if it is done well with the machine it is uh, hard enough to pass the wind resistance and you can see it is it is having adjust adjustment also now it is very hard so that you can get compression of the gasket and this will pass the PMU testing up to 5 kp also uh, and these are the type of different type of uh, strikers this is adjustable striker the logic is when you use a fixed pole you need to have the adjustable striker when you have an adjustable pole you need to have the fixed type of uh, striker any one of this you can have and when you have the fixed type of uh, pole just like this then the striker need to be uh, adjustable just like this this could be here and this uh, this could also be used here in this uh, if the pole is fixed then the the striker need to be adjustable if pole is adjustable striker could be fixed these two are the latest one which we have introduced this is the economical one it it looks like this and this is the fixed type it is already riveted in the base you just have to fix like you earlier used to use few more are there this is typhon type need to this could be used in this and this is uh, again a sort of uh, pole which need to be used like this and riveted from the back side hope you understood and like the video thank you